What is up, my AMC fam? What is up, my GME family? But most importantly, what is up, my retail family? It's your boy Mike coming at you from, you already know, AMC Movie Theaters out here in Temeca, California, okay? This is not financial advice. This is my own personal opinion. And before we get started, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, okay? Now, it's about 1120 out here in the West Coast, here in sunny Southern California. As you can see, it's a beautiful day. Now, also, this AMC Movie Theaters out here in Temecula, it's been jam-packed all summer long. It's been it's been just stacked and stacked with people and, um, and uh, movie uh, attendees, okay? The concession stands are full, and and so I'm looking for AMC earnings to have a, a great earnings, a phenomenal earnings, great numbers all the way out, all across the board for AMC, okay? Now, hopefully they'll have some type of good news for the retail investor, for us, because not only did we save the company, but we're also back to the company and we have not gone anywhere people are just holding and i know a lot of people have gone past the years when they bought just their initial shares so the capital gains tax has changed after holding for a year from the date of purchase of your shares okay now i do want to talk about the housing market for a split second before i get back to amc and gamestop okay now the housing market new home sales came out today and i mentioned this yesterday and these numbers were off they missed by a pretty big margin <laughs> new home sales were expected was supposed to be six hundred sixty thousand. we came in at five hundred ninety thousand. now the previous was like 400 uh, 640 some thousand uh give or take a few and they were expected to go up 640 some thousand to 660 thousand and turn it came in at 590 thousand obviously a big miss i think the miss is over eight percent overall just massive massive downside are, are just uh, a negative number okay now it's having an impact on the market i keep telling you the housing market is going to have an impact on the stock market and, and as well as many other things but is this the only reason why the house uh the stock market is pushing down today no it's not but consumer confidence is also having a major impact on the market okay now i gotta say this that um Affordability for housing is the lowest levels that's been in 15 years. Now, also, if you think back 15 years, that takes you back to 2007, and we already know what happened in 07. And I'm going to get there, but is this going to be worse? No, it's it's not it's not worse, or it's not even the same thing. It's just that the only thing is that there's other things going on worldwide that's going to have the same ramifications, uh, and we're going to hit from multiple sides. So I think overall, in the general sense, I think the downside that we have in the stock market or just in our economy is much greater than what happened in 07, as opposed just to being to housing. Okay. Now, also the mortgage rates mortgage rates right now are currently over about five and a half percent and a year ago from today okay in a 30-year fix about five and a half percent and a year ago from today uh those same numbers were about two and three quarters percent so it's about double okay so you're looking at you know obviously uh, cost of borrow has gone up you know a dramatic way uh affordability has gone up in a dramatic way and now people are trying to walk away <clears throat> excuse me from deals and houses and so forth okay now amc and gamestop what does it have to do with amc and gamestop i'll tell you right now it's very simple amc gamestop again we're in it for a short squeeze. The shorts haven't covered. Nothing hasn't changed. There's billions of synthetic shares out in the market. And all these institutions, these hedge frauds are over leveraged, okay? And you can see what's happening in the market today. It's red right all over the place. Now, I got to say this. Just a reminder, we got a rate hikes tomorrow. And after the rate hike is announced, you have Jerome Powell speaking. Again, who knows what's going to happen? I still say it's going to be 1%. Um, you know, people saying three quarters percent. I, I just got to say, it has to be 1%. If it's not, you're going to have just, it's sort of kicking the can down the road. Now, also, we still have GDP coming out on Thursday. This is going to have a major impact on the market as well as other people's earnings, okay? So that's all I have for today. And remember, just for AMC and GameStop, it's just nothing hasn't changed. The shorts haven't covered. We're still in for a short squeeze. Until they pay us, we're not going anywhere. Now, I just want to say RIP, God bless to everybody in BBIG because that is something... Um, that's the next level. And if you don't already know, it was B, uh, BBIG was actually trending on Twitter earlier today. So that's all I have. I'll see you later. Have a great day. God bless. And remember, the price of AMC is not the price of AMC. And the retail investor is always last to know. Stongs, baby. Peace.